Hi, I'm Lauren White. And I'm Stuart Brazel, and we're here in Beverly Hills for Tommy Davidson's birthday bash. 50th birthday bash. Woohoo! Let's see who we talk to. Hey guys, I'm with Nelson. Now we're here at Tommy Davidson's birthday bash. Talk to me about this fun event. Well, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I haven't seen Tommy in like 20 years. He owes me some money, so it'll be nice to get that $10 back. Are you charging him interest? <laughs> I should, I should, no, I've forgotten that. So you're in Hunger Games. This is obviously a huge month for you guys. Can you tell us about it? I'm, well, it's what, like nine days or maybe less? I, I'm thrilled, I'm so excited about it. I. I love to just talk on and on about it and reveal so many things about it, but I can't. What's your character? I play Flavius. I'm part of the prep team that preps uh, Katniss, played by Jennifer Lawrence, for all the games. So I do her hair and all that stuff. So Those are some of the best scenes because the costume and the hair, like what you guys do for this oh, is incredible. You see how we all look and how I look. They basically changed our look for every scene. We were like in seven scenes or something like that. And it's like the hair had to match the eyebrows, had to match the lips. It was crazy, but it was a lot of fun. I've been told I look like Elton John in one of them. I don't know. Oh, so Flavia slash Elton John, you decide. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. And I click on this, we're always interested in what you like to do social media wise online. Are you on Twitter, Instagram, what are your favorites? Uh, Twitter, I think I'm getting a little better at that. I have like two followers now. I'll follow <laughs> no, you. No, I have a few more than that. Uh, Twitter, Instagram, and uh, Facebook. And where can we cyber stalk you then? Give us your handles. Uh, our handles, that would be my name, right? Nelson underscore Asensio on Twitter. And uh, Nelson Asensio, there's a fan page on uh, Facebook. And Instagram, Nelson Asensio. Perfect. And I'll be looking for you out and about for Hunger yeah, Games. I hope so, too. Thank you so much. Nice to meet you. Nice Bye, guys. You I'm here with Bai Ling. How are you doing this evening? I'm good. How are you? I got a little bit of flu, but I'm getting over it. <laughs> well, I hope you, you took your um, immune and your vitamins. <laughs> um, I'm not used to it, but I start to. I think I've been working so hard, like shooting day and night. Maybe it's too much work. And uh, it's cold uh, in LA in the evening, so we're shooting evening a lot until late, and I don't wear much clothes. That's a problem. <laughs> so what are you working on? You're, you're shooting day and night. What are you working on? I'm working on a project. It's very prestigious. It's based on a novel, prize-winning novel. And uh, the role I got is leading lady role. was originally written for a white girl. So I memorized like a two, three pages monologue, so I read it, so I somehow I think I take their breath away, so I got the part. Very, 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 very excited. Well, can you tell us about it, or are you on Hush? Uh, a little bit Hush, but I can tell. If you follow me at Real Biling on Twitter, Instagram, or my Facebook, or officialbiling.com, you'll find out. It's, it's a little bit more, a little bit like a fifth shade of gray, but it's more provocative, more profound, more sophisticated, more sexy, and subtle. It's something I, I, I tell you now, if, when the film come out, the world is going to talk about. It's that unique. Well, I'm here with Sugar Ray. How are you? I'm fine. I'm doing great. So, Tommy Davidson's birthday. Are you guys friends? Well, we're very good friends. Tom is the best. Um, I first heard about Tommy when uh, a couple of my friends said, Ray, there's a guy who talks just like you. And when I saw him, I could not believe he sounds better than I do. Does he ever talk to you like you and it's just totally confusing? Uh, it's not really confusing because I know it's me. <laughs> but uh, he's a great guy. He's helped me out with my foundation. Tommy's my friend. And what have you been up to? What's going on? Just a number of things. Uh, I'm coming out with a collection, t-shirt collection, that will be sold in Saks. And I have a, a cap that's called Champ uh, that's coming out in spring. And uh, my foundation, which benefits... Uh, juvenile diabetes research so a number of things and uh, I'm happy and I want to be here for Tommy and is this a t-shirt that's part of your line this is not my really my line this is Sugar Ray Robinson's line who is my idol and um, hey you support his he'll support yours everybody supports one another right I love that I love that connection
And then are you on social media? Do you like to be on Twitter, Instagram, any of those things? I'm a little slow, but I am on Twitter and I'm on Facebook. And uh, that that social networking, it, it, it's so amazing, but it's, it's just so much. It's a full-time job. It is truly a full-time job. But you know what? I'm just getting the hang of it. Well, we'll start following you. Do you know what your handles are? Are they your name? At SugarRayLeonard.com. Follow him at Sugar Ray Leonard. Thank you so much. I'm here with Elisa Reyes from Nickelodeon. Yes. How do you know Tommy? Well, we worked on a show called The Proud Family on the Disney Channel. And it also aired on ABC Family. I played La Cienica Boulevardes. So we've gone way, way back since Disney time. And tonight we're celebrating his 50th. And I'm excited and we're going to have a blast. I can't believe he's 50. I just don't believe it. We don't age. Ethnicity does not age. He looks amazing. He does. <laughs> So how, tell us what you're working on other than The Proud Family. Um, I actually just got done producing a pilot, which I'm really excited. It's with Wesley Jonathan and Karen Ashley, and one of my co-stars from Nickelodeon as well, Katrina Johnson. Um, I just actually got a deal with a book in honor of my mom who passed away, unfortunately. And it's a kid's book that's being published, so that's coming out later this year. And working on a new radio show. I'm a little bit of a jack of all trades. That will be so fun. Yes. Are you going to do book signings and meet children? And That's the plan. I want to hit all the networks and QVC and Home Shopping Network and definitely get myself out there. And I think the kids market is great. That's how I met Tommy doing the tween market. So you can't, you know, go wrong. And you're nice and soft and furry tonight. I don't know if you can see her jacket, but you look fabulous. Well, thank you. You look darling, too. Why, thank you. <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you, and good luck with everything. Thank you so much. And before we go, yes. make sure you tell us your social media handles so we can follow you. Definitely. You can follow me on Twitter at Alisa, A-L-I-S-A-R-E-Y-E-S. -E -E thank you for being with us. Thank you so much. I am here with the man, the legend, Jim Brown. How are you this evening? I'm fine. How are you? I'm doing very well. So how do you know Tommy? Oh, I don't know. It's been many years. I don't even know when I met him, but I know that I've always known and respected him, liked him, and I'm here tonight to uh, pay that respect. Well, that's very kind of you. It doesn't hurt that there's going to be some festivities either, does it? Oh, well, you know, Tommy likes festivities. And, Who doesn't? Uh, and this is Hollywood, so... Uh, you know, I'm looking forward to that. My wife and I are very happy to be here together to have some fun, too. So what are you doing with yourself these days? Well, that uh, is a general question. I work uh, with the Cleveland Browns, for the Cleveland Browns. Uh, I run a program called the American Program. We try to uh, help with the violence in our cities and the education of our kids. And uh, anything else I can do to be relevant. Which is excellent. Can you give us the website for that? Monique, you know the website? www.americann.org. So you guys are going to want to visit that. Are you also on social media? We are. Twitter is American32, at American32. American32, at American32. No, I just, oh. at Ameri <laughs> American32. <laughs> so at American32. Follow them, like them, and check it out. And hey, guys, I'm here with one of my absolute favorites, Taylor Dane. It's so good to see you. Thank you, honey. So Great Tommy to Davidson's birthday. Have you known Tommy a while? Um, yeah. I mean, we're digging into the vault here. Yeah. Tommy I've known for many, many years, and we've ran into each other numerous times over the course of, I would say, the last 15, 17 years. Mm -hmm. In New York, for sure. And LA it's now. a fun story with him, right? He's just a light, you know, a, a, always lights up the room. Lovely, lovely man. And um, I'm here with a couple of friends and his girlfriend, and it'll be nice. It'll be a fun evening. Fun. What have you been up to? You're always so busy being fabulous, but fill us in. <laughs> I've got to get more fabulous then because um, I, I'm, I've uh, been touring pretty extensively the last year. Yeah, this year has been really busy and um, just moved. So now all that's settling down. Holidays are here with my kids a little bit. And uh, it's time to make some music, actually. See, I saw you. I went with uh, my dear friends, Nikki and Jill. We saw you over in Los Feliz when you did your show, and it was awesome. Thank you. Yeah, I just did Broadway again, and I'm I'm home now, and it feels good. And it's just, uh, I've had a really fabulous, entertaining year for my fans, and now i got to make some more music. I really feel it's time to get creative again. you got to get in that studio. Yeah, i, I got to start digging in the basket again, yes. So speaking of fans, are you on social media? Is that a way that you like to interact with your fans? It's funny. Um, 
Facebook, not so much for me, other than for my fans. Yes, it's informative and I like that, but I'm not, you know, I'm not glued to that on a daily basis. I'm constantly moving. Um, as far as the shorter, more, you know, uh, quick turnarounds and socially I love my Twitter and I do love my Instagram I love sharing you know instant um, I guess instant messages with my fans that way and I like you know I would say communicating with them on those mediums and you know I'm not basically on my YouTube fans are getting a joyful every time they see me live God knows what else is on YouTube and I just think it's an incredible way and the world has just gotten real teeny and it's an amazing uh, it's amazing to see you know yeah, I am here with Mr. Bill Bellamy, who yes. is much taller than I am. Everybody says, like, oh, my God, he's so tall in real life. Well, I guess you, you don't look short on TV, but you look shorter. Right. <laughs> and I'm wearing heels. That's the funny thing. Yeah, well, I'm excited to be here tonight. How do you Tommy, Tommy? Tommy, you know, has been a friend of mine for, like, 15, 20 years. And uh, he actually was, like, the first guy to ever take me to my first Hollywood party. And I always loved that about him because I was a new jack in the game. And he just said, hey, you Bill Bellamy from New York, Jersey. And he brought me into this like dope, dope Oscar party. And tonight it's about him, his 50th. I'm here to support and give him a big hug and, and say, keep, keep rocking. So what are you working on recently? Well, I got I have a new TV series called Mr. Box Office that's in syndication right now. I have my Ladies Night Out comedy tour that is uh touring the nation. I'm going to Utah next, this week coming up. Following week, uh, I will be in Richmond, and then I go to New York to tape Rachel Ray. I'm doing uh, co-hosting 10 episodes with her, and uh, also... Uh, that ought to be really interesting. Yeah, a lot of fun. I'm learning some cooking tips. And then also, too, I got Crazy Sexy Dirty, which is my one-hour special now, out on Netflix, so you can laugh with me instantly. Okay. I am so here ahead. with... <laughs> Well, he's going to talk before I am. I'm here with the birthday boy celebrating your, what, 28th birthday? 28th. Mr. 28th Tommy Davidson. times uh, about 23 more or something. No, that would be plus, not time. Yeah, something like that. So how are you feeling tonight? I'm feeling good. It's overwhelming, man. You got see all these people, people that I know. I got people from my old neighborhood. I got old acting friends. I got athletes that I know. This is like 30 years of like... 30 years of entertainment coming into one. 28. Yeah, 28, 28, yeah. And you look amazing. What she says. You don't look a day over, what, 25? Thank you. Actually, you do look All phenomenal. I'll say is thank you to that. I, I can't believe that you're 50. It's just amazing. Thank you. But is it, it's exciting, right? It's really exciting. It's really, I mean, the most exciting part of it is that I just started. Better with age, like a fun Yeah, life. I just started. Like, you know, this has been great, but all this good stuff starts now. And you can get away with it because you know how to. Yeah, I do. It's, it's, it's taken a while. So, like you, I am from Maryland. Oh, and yeah? I'm very excited to hear about your Maryland experiences. Okay, okay, and okay. And what, what brought you to choose comedy and move all over the world and do stand-up and one of my favorite shows in Living Color? Well, it, it, I was working at the Ramada Inn, okay? And I had Fancy. a choice. Do I go into stand-up comedy or do I stay at the Ramada Inn? So we packed up the Nissan Sentra, came to L.A., and I took our shot at it. Yeah. And obviously succeeded. It worked. It really worked. So tell us what you're working on now. Um, I'm working on a uh, film for Sammy Davis Jr. A Black Dynamite is in its second season on Adult Swim. Uh, Chocolate Sundays just came out, a cable special of mine. Uh, going on the road, going back to Afghanistan again. You know, working on a television show, comedy special. You're just a busy man. And on and on and on. And and you probably keeps you young, right? Oh, all of this keeps me young. Because you're running all over the place. Oh, all over the place. You know that. I'm barely getting places. But this is the first red carpet I think I was on time to. And it's all for you. Yeah, it is. It's just for you. Yeah, it is. Well, we hope you guys had fun. You know what? Let's go to the party. It's a good night to party. And you're watching? Click on this. You're watching Click On This, baby. And that's from Sammy Davis Jr. and Tommy Davidson. Click, man. And I mean it, babe. Hey, this is Bill Bellamy, actor, comedian, crazy man. And you are watching Click On This. Click it.